Welcome to Electron Line. Now let's add up double digit numbers together. There's different kinds of situations that you might run into. In this particular case, we'll call that case one, where you look at the first two numbers that represents 20 and 30. When you add them together, that makes less than 10. And if you add the two last numbers together and you bring them together, that adds up to less than 10. Again, 2 plus 4 is less than 10, 3 plus 4 is less than 10, 1 plus 5, 3 plus 2, 3 plus 5, and 6 plus 1. Every time you get a number less than 10, that would be the first type of double digit numbers we need to add. When that's the case, that makes it very straightforward. We simply add the first two numbers together, 20 plus 30. What you do is you write, you can say 2 plus 3 is 5, and my first number here becomes a 5. The second number, 4 plus 1, that's 5. The second number becomes 5. In other words, 20 plus 30 and 4 plus 1 gives me 50 plus 5 or 55. Let, let's write that down. We have 20 plus 30 from the first two numbers, that is 50. And we have 4 plus 1, that is 5. Add them together, you get 55. Same over here, 23 plus 44. Add the two first numbers together, 2 plus 4, that is 6. 3 plus 4, that is 7. In other words, we have 20 plus 40, which is 60, and 3 plus 4, which is 7, 67 altogether. The next exercise here, we have 1 plus 5, which is 6, 3 plus 2, which is 5. What we did was we added 10 plus 50, which gave us 60. We added 3 plus 2, which gave us 5. 60 plus 5 is 65. And our last exercise, here we see that 3 plus 5 is 8, 6 plus 1 is 7. What we did here was we took 30, we added that to 50 to give us 80. We took 6, add that to 1, we get 7. 80 plus 7 is 87. So you can see that when you have double digit numbers, and when you add the first two numbers together, it's less than 10. You add the second two numbers together, it's less than 10. It makes it fairly easy to do that. And that's the first type of double digit additions that we can encounter. On the next video, we'll see something slightly different, where some of the numbers add up to more than 10, and then we'll see what we need to do in that case. So stay tuned if you're interested.